Hello, my name is Akshat. I am from Midshare Technologies and I would be your tutor for the digital art course with Photoshop. Okay, so in this class, uh, we'd be learning about uh, some different brushes that Photoshop has and how to import an image as well. So let's start. Importing images is pretty easy in Photoshop. It's uh, like dragging and dropping the image, whatever the image is. Uh, if uh, I am to select this image, the Apple one, I can just drag and drop uh, it onto our canvas and uh, it would uh, be like imported. So that's how you import the uh, files onto Photoshop. But uh, could you be edit karne ke days pe, we would have to actually rasterize it. Because if I go here and use my magic wand tool, ko use karu, by this uh, we can remove backgrounds and select chunks of the same color. If my base color is a natural color, I can delete this color. Or I can delete any part of the image. Delete kar sakta. So magic wand tool helps us in selection, deleting and doing a ton of stuff that we would be going over. So if I select this here and just delete it, you would see that this is giving me an error. De hai. So to bypass this error, you would have to go over here and uh, we have to right click on it and isse rasterize it. Once you rasterize the layer, uh, it would be easy to delete and now you have this transparent PNG kind of thing. So this is, the, this is how uh, you import files onto Photoshop. Now let's move on to brushes. There's a lot of brushes that we would be going over. But first, let's see ki hum yaha se toolbox se brush select kar sakte hain or even agar hum koi aur tool pe hain, jase move tool pe hain, we can just press B on the keyboard to go on to the brush. Ab brush tool mein hume bhoat saare options milte hain. Agar mein sabse pehle option ki baat karo, so it's the direction or like the stroke thing. So this uh, whole the gizmo helps you to choose how the stroke lands onto the canvas. So we can give it strokes de sakte hain. that helps us into creating better art. So we can decide strokes from here. We saw the size of the size, we can open the size up and down. We have hardness as well. Hardness will help, if I take a airbrush or soft brush, leta hon, and uh, soft brush pe aap dekhenge ki there is like uh, a blur on the edges of it so agar mujhe ye blur jo hai ise thoda sa hard feel karana hai to like wo blur na rahe to main hardness padaunga agar main hardness ko pura kar deta hu we would have a solid uh, color so this would help us like minimize that whole blur around the edges kind of thing we can also just choose hard round and then then do the same thing but uh, there is an option to like manipulate that as well so this will be helpful on the different brushes that we have there's a lot of brushes soft round is the airbrush that we use this is to blend stuff as well hard is for creating base color or like the fill color that we have and there's a lot of pencil brushes as well this will help you into creating the outlines of the stuff like if I can show you, we can see that there is an effect in it. Like there is a feel of like texture wali feel aari hai, wo pencil. Wali. So we will do the textures in the future when we will make our pencil se apna card. In the future, we have a wet media brush which we will coloring. Karenge. This will give us that uh, watercolor kind of feel. So we have a lot of brushes and some brushes you can even import that as well. We would be going over that as well but uh, if I go to brush wale tag mein jaun, on the toolbar and if I right click karta hon, we can see that we have 4 options in which the main hamara brush tool hota hai and mixer tool hota hai. let's go over why these two are very important so if I go to my brush tool mein jata hon, and let's just uh, select a red color yeah so if I go to my brush tool mein jata hon, and red color leta hon, and just paint this red. I would also suggest ki there is also one more shortcut that you can use. Hum, humare layer pe agar select karte hain aap pe, we can just uh, like if you control and select on the layer, 
हमारा आउटलाइन सेलेक्ट होगा सो वट एवर वी डू विल स्टे इन दैट आउटलाइन सो दिस इज हाउ यू लाइक स्टे इन साइड द लेयर एंड नॉट गो इन द बैकग्राउंड इफ यू हैव लाइक अ ट्रांसपेरेंट काइंड थिंग सो इससे मेरे को हेल्प मिलेगी इफ आई जस्ट कलर द रेड थिंग सो दिस दिस इज हाउ यू कैन कलर इन फोटोशॉप अगर मैं मेरे इस पर पूरा रेड दे देता हूँ सो दिस इज हाउ यू कैन लाइक क्रिएट बेस कलर्स और लाइक फिल कलर फॉर इट मैं पूरे उस पर नहीं दूँगा बिकॉज मैं अभी आपको दिखाऊंगा हाउ टू मिक्स एज वेल सो द मिक्स ब्रश अगर मैं यहाँ पे एक हल्का सा हाईलाइट देता हूँ एंड जस्ट लाइक एक और बेस कलर यहाँ पे दे देते हैं हल्का सा इधर पे एंड थोड़ा सा डार्क जो है उसे ऑन दी एजेस दे देता हूँ लाइक दिस This is not shading. I'm just telling you how to like blend stuff. So we would be going over shading as well in the next classes. But this is to understand how brushes actually work. So now, when my brush, yeah, the mixer brush select will be, and I just like mix onto this. Make sure that whatever color you have done, it will be on one layer. If it is on two layers, it won't mix. so after doing that if we do this you can see ki wo jo dark part hai hamara wo mix ho ke hamare red part pe bhi aa gaya so it's giving that depth onto it aur aap dekhe so just agar main usko bas normal stroking karta hu so it would provide us with that Shading is something that you get used to. It takes a long time to like uh, get perfected in it. And her ek uh, image ya canvas me bahut saari shading ki zarurat padti hai. So after that, yahan pe jo mera highlight hai, main ise bhi shade karta hu. कि वो जो आउटलाइन थे वो भी शेड हो रहे हैं बट दिस इज जस्ट डेमोन्स्ट्रेट कि हमारा शेडिंग या मेजर ब्रश करता क्या सो so, अगर आप इसमें देखेंगे तो यू कैन सी वी वी हैव दैट काइंड ऑफ लाइक शेडेड पार्ट एज वेल सो अगर मैं इसे और ब्लेंड करता हूँ तो इट विल प्रोवाइड अस विथ अ लिटिल डेप्थ ऑन टू द थिंग so that is how we can use these brushes to actually provide like depth and blend it with depths highlights and everything we would be going over this when we would talk about shading but these are the basic like brushes that we would be using throughout the course so i hope you explore these brushes and uh, i'll see you in the next class